Have you ever felt a calming presence in a space that defies traditional notions of perfection? Where rough-hewn stone complements smooth wood and the passage of time is celebrated rather than concealed. This, my friends, is the realm of wabi-sabi, an ancient Japanese philosophy that embraces the beauty of imperfection. Today, we embark on a captivating journey to discover how wabi-sabi is redefining modern architecture. We'll explore 10 incredible projects from around the world, each a testament to the power of finding beauty in the natural, the simple, and the impermanent. But what exactly is wabi-sabi? Is it a design trend, a way of life, or something more profound? Let's unravel its secrets together, learn how it's shaping the future of design, and discover why imperfection might just be the key to unlocking true beauty. So grab your favorite warm beverage, settle in, and prepare to be inspired. This is more than just a tour of architectural marvels. It's an invitation to redefine your own perception of beauty and embrace the transformative power of wabi-sabi. Welcome to the world of wabi-sabi design. Let's, Let's begin. begin. Wabi-sabi is the most beloved interior design trend of the moment. Wabi-sabi is a Japanese philosophy that embraces the beauty of imperfection. It is the appreciation of becoming old. Wabi-sabi looks into life and into design as imperfect, impermanent, and incomplete. In design, this philosophy includes the wrinkles in the curtains, the patina on the walls, and the cracks in a wood panel. Overall, the philosophy invites homeowners to feel at peace and ease in their homes, flaws, and all. This results in unfinished but thoughtful design choices since imperfections add character and beauty to your interiors. Wabi-sabi centers on simplicity, imperfections, and impermanence. It encourages design lovers to let go of perfection and welcome the natural cycle of life. The philosophy shows that the fleeting nature of life has unique charms. There's a refreshing rustic air to the style that's usually carried out through organic elements and a neutral palette. It's common to find matte finishes, textured pieces, and clutter-free spaces in wabi-sabi interiors. Choose natural elements. If you're a seasoned plant parent, watching your plant grow from a seed to the beauty, it is now reflects its story of growth in your home. Deep olive green leaves will also add color to your space. Go for texture. The more matte, the better. You'll also find patina, lime wash paint, wrinkled linens, chalky clay, and weathered wood finishes in a wabi-sabi home. A minimalist touch. This choice allows you to choose what is simple but important. Simplicity is needed to clear your mind and space of clutter so you're able to live comfortably. Get personal with decor. Sentiment and authenticity are key to wabi-sabi. If an item was passed down in your life, give it a special moment in your decor. Shop for vintage items instead of a new ones that don't have history attached to them. Stick to a neutral but moody color palette. Neutral colors like warm whites and taupe 
will help your space feel cozy. Accents in sage, olive, dusty rose, or terracotta can be used sparingly throughout the space to set an earthy atmosphere. Don't overlook items that age. The weathered look can work on your behalf and add depth. To follow the wabi-sabi principle of impermanence, decorate with objects that naturally age, like a tarnished vase, polished brass, copper, or handmade pottery. Accept asymmetry. Slants and tilts only add beauty. The irregularities in the composition of a room or an item make it less sterile, allowing you to mix and match and avoid a uniform look. Asymmetry is commonly seen in the wabi-sabi art of ikebana, a traditional Japanese flower arrangement practice that uses asymmetrical forms. It is a reminder that we should appreciate the beauty of the world around us, even in its imperfections.